Hello YouTube, how is everyone doing? It's Professional here. Welcome back to my playthrough of GTA 4. And today here we're continuing the next part. And I believe that we should be getting a phone call from Mallory any moment now. Oh, there it is. Nico, I think Roman has been kidnapped. I heard he owes some Russians money. A friend of mine saw him at that car club on some point. He owed them money? He never told me anything. I heard they took him to a warehouse off Bomb Park in Bohan and Dutch. I'll check it out. So you heard that um, Roman has been gambling in one of the Russian Mafia's clubs. And remember, Dimitri is still looking for Nico. So now we're gonna go and check out this, um... We're gonna go and check out this warehouse that Roman has supposedly been taken to. This is actually one of the best missions in uh, GTA 4. Text message from Dimitri. Nico, I thought I would send you this picture. Looks like your you cousin the line, Dimitri. is in a bit of a fix. Your friend Dimitri. Wow. And you can actually call Dimitri right after this. I got your message, Dimitri, you piece of shit. You're a dead man. A dead man. Before you die, I'm going to cut your face off. Then I'm going to hang it on my wall to remind me what a lying, cheating, treacherous scumbag looks like. Goodbye, friend. So now we're going to be saving Roman. And this shows you much of a psychopath Dimitri is. Dimitri, I would say, is probably the most ruthless GTA antagonist of all time. I think he's even more ruthless than Tenpenny. There's actually an AK-47 that you can find right here. If you say so. Beer, hash, and prostitutes. That's my perfect evening. <laughs> what an ass fucker you are. If you want to walk out of here, Slav, you're going to have to think about how you will pay your debt. A friend of mine, Dmitry Raskolov, he would pay a lot of money for your cousin. I'll get you the money, just not that way. If I smoked any more, I wouldn't have time to eat. I'm with Roman is on the top floor. Rescue him. This is going to be good. We're going to wipe out the Russian mafia here. An explosive barrel. I just love how Nico just yells at them during this mission. He can tell how pissed off he is. We got an armor right here. Now is your time. You think that's an explosive kit. Yep, okay, it was an explosive.
Well, we just wait. Well, wow, look at that. <laughs> How many of these guys have we killed? Shit! No! Please! No! You are Nico Bellic. Turn around and walk away, or your cousin is dead. I am not afraid of death. When she comes for me, I shall embrace her. Thank you, cousin! You saved my life! We should get out of here! There's a car! Take me home, cousin! Yeah, probably best to get out of here before the police show up. But uh, if you play the Lost and Damned, they actually show how Roman got kidnapped. Cousin. You must lose a little to win a lot. Come on, my cards were not good. Roman! That man knew Dimitri. Let's take the, um, Patriot. Of course you would not. Dimitri has taken this too far. He wants you dead. Bohan is not safe. I, I, I'm going to get us a place in Algonquin. Are you okay? I'm used to taking these beatings, Nico. I almost expect it now. Wherever I go, there are people who want to kill me. Men who will kidnap me. I'll never marry Mallory. I won't be able to sleep with another college girl. There is a knife hanging over me. A clock is ticking. And, um... Like I said before, I'm gonna have a really good lore video coming up on Dimitri, but when I make my lore video on Dimitri, I wanna um, wait until I beat the game. So I wanna beat the game first, and then I'll talk about Dimitri. I'll break his character down, I'll do a full character analysis on him. This is out of control. I know. What are we going to do? I don't know. We're going to die. I don't want to die, man. Not like this. How would you like to die? Huh. Having a threesome on my hundredth birthday? I don't fucking know. I'm scared, you cold bastard. What are we going to do? I'm not cold. You're cold. All you care about is revenge and getting your own way. And all you care about is money and gambling it away on the internet. Oh, isn't America great? I get to sit in front of a computer and play Mr. Rich Man and get him to death with crooks. Okay, I messed up. I know I did. I thought things would be different. I, I don't understand this place so good. Oh, man, what are we going to do? Stop sitting in front of the computer gambling our money. Stop uh, getting into illegal card games. Stop spending all our money. Yes. Thank you. And stop thinking about the Russians. Men... We just need to disappear, as far as they're concerned. Disappear! Okay, okay. But I want Florian and Darko. I need to know what happened. Give me that. Fine, but leave the Russians alone. I was not the one gambling in their private club. I didn't know! Give a guy a break! Okay, okay. Okay. I'm going to clean up. I have a nasty feeling I had a bit of an accident back there. And Nico. What? Thanks. Probably turn on audio, um... And Dimitri is actually in the, uh, going to call you again, uh, I believe. Thanks a lot. Hey, cuz, thanks for saving me back there. I thought I'd played my last hand when that biker guy kidnapped me for the Russians. You're a hero, man. So, um, biker guy. Yeah, the Lost and Damned actually explains that. And this is how, you know, the three stories actually connect really well together. Cousin, 
I have bought us a present. You bought it or I did? <laughs> Nico, I'm offended. I've got us an apartment in Algonquin. What did I say when you got here? Penthouse. Model on each arm. And you have paid for this place? It wasn't so long ago that your debts got you kidnapped by the Russian mob. That was a cold streak. Now I'm hot, cousin. Hotter than the models will be bedding. I can't lose! Roman, we have spoken about your gambling. Wait until you see the new place, NB. You'll change your song. So what? I took on a little debt. So there's a new safe house in Algonquin. We'll go check that out after this mission here. Oh, here we go, Dimitri. Nico, it's Dimitri. I have nothing to say to you. I nearly ran into your cousin the other day. My friends were uh, hanging out with him. The party got busted up, though, before I got there. I wish you had been there. We could have had some fun. Not as much fun as I would have had with Roman, believe me. Dimitri is such a piece of crap. It's like, I, I hate this guy so much. Like, oh, Rockstar logo on the thing here, but uh, Dimitri is the most ruthless and I would say evil GTA antagonist of all time. Like, out of all the antagonists, he's the most evil, I, in my personal opinion. I think he's more evil than Tenpenny. Look where you're going, man. Thank you. I like how Nico just froze it on the ground for him. So in New York, it's actually pretty common where you'll actually have street performers and you actually have artists on um, corners. That is pretty common. So um, here, we're going to this um, uh, unknown Nico. Meet me at the end of the pier at Castle Gardens. I'm gonna see who this is now. Call and collect. Remember this guy? This is Francis McCreary. He met with Manny. Were you followed? Hey, strange seeing you here, Officer McCreary. I told you to come here, fucking maggot. You did? Why? I know about you. Know what? I know enough, boy. Oh, what do you know, boy? I know you killed Mikhail Faustin. I know a group of Russians want you dead. I know you ain't no saint, boy. I don't know what you're talking about, Chief. <laughs> You think this is a town that can keep a secret? I really don't know what you're talking about. Yeah, you do. You know that a man's gotta do what a man's gotta do. That people ain't perfect, that life is a mess. Sure, everybody knows that. So, you look out for me, and I don't look out for you. <laughs> know what I mean? I think so. So there's a guy trying to blackmail me. Who? I don't know. Thinks he's getting paid, though. The guy's smart. He arranged to do the exchange by the Humboldt River off Silicon Street. Said to call him from the viewpoint there. Okay. Listen, I did what I did. Hmm. I made a mistake. That don't make me the devil. Now, obviously, I can't go, because then he gets a picture of me giving him money, and I'm admitting guilt. I ain't guilty of nothing other than being a man. To be honest, I don't really care one way or another. Well, I'm a good man. No doubt. Now call me when you get to the spot. Francis just says that I'm a good man. Now, Francis is a pretty um, complicated character. Um, I'm trying to remember what he is. He's a, he's a very high-up police officer. I think he's a lieutenant right now. I think he, he says that in the game he wants to become the commissioner of police, which is a pretty high position. But, um, Francis is very corrupt, as you can tell, and, um, and he, he also claims that he, um, he believes in, like, a strong sense of justice, and he has Nico, like, um, go and kill a bunch of criminals also in other missions. How far is this? Oh, that's a pretty far drive. Let's call Roman for a, a ride. Car service. Roman, my cousin. I'd really like a cab if you could send one to me. Anything for you, Wendy. It should be there soon. Look at this uh, new car now. Roman's taxi business has been going good now for him.
Roman is doing well. You see this new car, my friend? We better get this over with. You better be enjoying yourself back there, because I'm hating every second I have to drive you around for free. Yeah? Well, maybe you should chill out. You're going to have a heart attack getting so angry the whole time. You know how much a driver can get paid in this city? Shit. <laughs> a yellow cab is just a license to steal, man. This don't pay too bad. When I'm driving real fares, that is. Not just Roman's stupid cousin. You don't like driving me talk to Roman. He can send one of his other drivers. You'd love that, wouldn't you? Get a hard-working father of six fired because he didn't treat you like God's gift to the earth. You're cold, man. Ice cold. You really want me to get fired? No, of course I don't want you to get fired. You got a job to do. Shit, I didn't realize you had six kids. Well, I probably got about six kids. My wife hasn't had any yet, but the amount of pussy I get, man, there has to be some out there, doesn't there? You know? Sure, whatever you say, lover man. I don't know what he's doing right now when it comes to the driving, but I love listening to Muhammad's conversations. There's several conversations between him and Nico. Um, this is the point where normal customers pay. Go away, head dick. <laughs> oh man. So this, what's going on here is there's some guy that's actually blackmailing Francis, and Nico, uh, he wants Nico to find out who he is and kill him. I'm in the park. Now what? All right. This guy told me to bring the money there and call him. That means he's somewhere close, and he's got a phone. I'm gonna text you his number. You know you've you got to call up. him and keep a lookout for someone answering a phone. He won't be far. Okay, now, um, we don't actually need to go up here, um... Okay, so, um, you just, uh, what we're gonna do now is we're gonna call this number here. And we're gonna look out for somebody specifically that is answering a phone. A friend. I'm calling about your exchange with McCreary. Yeah? Yeah? You better have, you better my, have paper. my paper. I ain't, I ain't fucking, fucking around. around. I'm sure he's got your money. Have you got the stuff he wants? Yeah. Yeah, I got, I got it. it. We're gonna make, We're gonna this, make this, shit this shit happen. I don't miss, I don't miss around, around you know. Push, Push me, and this, and this shit, shit is all over Weasel, Weasel News. news. I, got I got them on speed, speed dial. dial. Really? Yeah. yeah. And, and there's a lawyer called Tom Goldberg who's real interested. He's hungry for McCreary's blood and shit. Yeah. Good thing Francis is paying then. Call, Call me when this exchange, exchange is going down. down. I don't like, I don't like all the talking. Yeah. Yeah. Uh -huh. This place is fucking packed. Ooh, nice ass. This guy's out of his mind. There we go. Okay. Oh, lose the wanted level. Then realize we're gonna get a wanted level right after that. But okay, let's get out of here then. I guess we didn't have the confrontation because the call ended, but if you walk, walk up to him right when he's um, on the phone, Nico will actually confront him, and then he'll try to make a break for it. Oh, great. Okay, we gotta get out of here. Okay, let's get out of here then. Cops were pretty reasonable to lose in this game. They had that new system, so like the the orb on the map, that was a whole brand new system that was added in GTA 4. Okay, there we go. Take the photographs um, uh, on the storage device to Francis. Okay, let's get out of here then. Here, he's dead. Great, 
I can get rid of these now. I feel like a new man. Not many people get a second chance like this. It's my redemption. Your sins are absolved, I guess. Thanks. LCPD, isn't this a weird place to go to start a mission? <laughs> Police station. Oh, crazy drivers. Okay. Final interview. Have a nice uh, day. Uh, hey, uh, Jimmy, how you yeah, doing? Uh, come on, Jimmy, uh, let's go to my office. Okay, that's it, Jim, sir. Let's you're undercover. Up, uh, see Daisy. Uh, hey, Chief. Uh, hey, Mitch, looking good. Gastric bypass worked out well for you, I see. Yeah, thanks. I'll tell my therapist about you. Tell him my boss keeps sexually harassing me. Oh, yeah, you wish. Oh, I could use a drink. You? No. Uh, Oh, the motherfucker thinks he can drag me down. What's wrong now? Oh, man. Uh, sure. Listen, uh, where to begin? I don't know. Let me put it like this. If a guy makes a mistake, should that uh. ruin his life? Now, people don't understand how life is. Life is like a, a bowl of fruit, slowly rotting in a hot hey, kitchen. I don't give a fuck about the life lessons, friend. What do you want? I'm a good guy. I... He's got it all wrong. He's got... But one stain on my character, and I'm finished. I want to make a difference. What? <sighs> Some lawyer. This big white shoe firm thinks he's a crusader some morality cunt who takes photos of guys in the shower at the gym and then jacks off on his wife's face hey some... enough enough sorry look the guy's name is tom goldberg thinks he's got something on me I'm gonna go to the da with it use it to get into the da is the district attorney okay yeah so it's him or me and it might as well be him, right? But he's hard to get to. Guy's got a bodyguard, limo, everything. You're gonna need to get one-on-one -on -one with him. Not in the showers. Not in the showers, <laughs> a job interview. <laughs> then you can steal some files I need. An interview? Sure, it'll be easy. You're an immigrant. They're almost legally bound to interview you. But, uh... Get yourself a suit. Okay. I will email you the details. You're a good man, Nico Bellic. A good man. Uh, coming from you, that means a lot. It does. <laughs> so let me know what you guys think of Francis there. Um, uh, but like I said, he's a bit of a complicated character. And then there's a de there's, de there's a decision later in the game. I'm um, not gonna spoil anything. But, um, I'll talk about it when it gets to it. It's a very hard decision. Okay, we go to the internet cafe. Can I get you a smoke a lot latte? Wow, we got a lot of emails here. Let's, um, let's check all the emails that we got here. From Brucey, you, uh, NB, you see this? Um, you dial 948 on your phone and it tells you whatever track is playing in the background. I guess there's a room full of geeks in some warehouse listening to all the songs or something. That's how it's done. It's awesome for impressing the, well, Brucey's language with your music knowledge. Not that many cut abs, bulging pecs, and monster-sized bar tabs don't impress them enough. You get me, Alpha. A lot of player like you would appreciate this stuff. Hey, man, that could be useful. I'll try it on the radio ad and see... I, I can tell that a steroid pump fantasist is talking. Dwayne. It's Dwayne, man. Just thought I'd holla at you on this email. I don't write too good, but uh, you ain't from here even, so what does it matter to you? Man, I don't got too many friends no more. De these days is real lonely like me. Why don't you and me hang out some? Kick it, you know. That could be good. So remember, Dwayne is now available as a friend because we saved his life. Sure, Dwayne. That could be good. Francis. 
You might want to look at Goldberg. Um, there's a job in the recruitment section. I think he'd be perfect. Have a killer interview. Deputy Commissioner F McCreary. Let's look at the other emails first before we... Um... Thank you for your email. It made me cry. Um, muy, dr muy dragi sin. My, um, uh... My loving son, I think that's what it means. Um, muy drogi sin. Um, uh, very similar to Polish, because Nico's language is Serbian, so I think, I think, correct me if I'm wrong, I think that's what it means. Um, my, my loving son, or my, um, thank you for your email, it made me cry. At least you are well happy. I know you cannot live here and be well. I hope happiness finds you. Look after, um, cousin. He is good boy. I dream of both of you settling down with nice women. It is what his mother would have wanted as well. I will write soon. Your loving mother. Um... And that's the thing, is you see how, like, a ne a Nico's mother, her en her English isn't, isn't that good. You can tell right from the email, so, like, they put effort into that. Um, they tried to make it so, you know, the grammar was more realistic for, like, somebody that's n their English isn't their first language. Brucey. Found this website called uh, VIPLuxuryRingtones.com. You can drop some major dollars on ringtones and themes. Bro, whatever you bring out, uh, uh, bring out yourself. <laughs> Man. When they scope my lats and then hear my VIP $100 ringtone, they know that Brucey's alpha. High roller like you should check that out. Okay. I'll check out the site. Thanks, Brucey. Listen, thanks for doing that. I didn't think you'd mind dating a guy after all that time in the Merchant Navy. Brucey's really grateful. He'll be a good contact for us. Anyways, listen, I know you'll be mad, but I've been having a run of bad luck. The thing about luck is it changes, so maybe you can bail me out. Nothing crazy. Think of it as an investment. I hereby make you a minority shareholder in Roman Pelic Enterprises. I'm the CEO or in business cousin. This is negatively responding on this. You're a moron. Stop gambling. You don't have bad luck. You have bad judgment. Huh. <laughs> Michelle was working for someone? I don't know what to say. See you later. Negative two. Maybe you could say that you're a moron and you won't set me up any any more undercover agents or cops. Greetings, Bellic Nico. We need a vendor who can supply. I offer 5,000 US dollars just for referring a vendor, which is reliable in providing contact details of vendor required. If they turn out to be reliable in supplying the equipment, I'll immediately pay you $5,000. 800 horsepower jackhammer warper generator. Dimensional war... Tiny... If in stock, the module contains international business. This is some kind of scam or spam email. So you even get spam emails in um uh in um uh in GTA 4. And the amount of spam that 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 people get in emails is ridiculous. Like thank God that spam folders exist, or the amount of spam that people would get. Like I I looked at spam folders before. Like it's ridiculous. Like the amount of stupid emails that you get and there's also so many scams in this e in these emails and sometimes the scams appear in just regular emails so you guys got to watch out when you, uh when you read emails online women and men in your area looking to hook up with you tonight and order babies over the internet viewer extensive and revealing picture ba free of charge babies um no thank you i'm not gonna click on that Oh, and there was the exotic car. We'll read the- we'll get the exotic cars from Brucey, um, uh, Brucey, um, another time, but, uh... has been sent to your phone. Okay, so we bought the, um... Okay, and let's see. Francis's email now. Go to the careers page. Click to submit resume. Career of resume of Nico Bellic, career objective, rise to the top of my profession in Liberty City. Bellic and Bellic attorneys at law. Partner, involvement in criminal law, particular cases of manslaughter, homicide, drug dealing, extortion, racketeering, and grand theft auto. Launched and successfully tried cases against corrupt individuals, including division heads and company CEOs. Dealing with emerging markets in the West Indies, particularly Jamaica and Puerto Rico. Instrumental in trading of commodities from those emerging markets. Streamlined the company by making difficult but important redundancies. There's no way that Nico, um, uh, uh, that Nico put this together. I think that Francis, um, uh, I think that Francis wrote this for him. The, the, the English is just too good here. Because Nico's English isn't, isn't amazing. Mediterranean Shipping Enterpri Enterprise. Associate, um, uh, Associate Attorney drafted it, 
immigration documentation and accelerated customs procedures for clients. Worked with many European markets, including Balkan states, Italy and Russia, Balkan Peace Force, intern. Worked in war-torn areas to assist those mostly badly affected, settled vital disputes with clinical and decisive action, compensated for lack of experience, with enthusiasm and willing to list to learn. Education, Vespucci University School of Law, a Jewish doctor, um, that's actually um, uh, Vespucci University, I believe, in Los Santos, class rank top 1%. Bulford University, United Kingdom, MA, International Relations, First Class Degree, Blue of Boxing, Skills, People Management, Coping of Cultural Differences, Athletic Ability, Shooting, <laughs> Shooting, Boxing, Running, Swimming, to a Professional Level, World of Force, Affairs, Importing and Exporting Goods, Free Market Competition. Thank you for submitting your resume. We will call you ASAP with further details. I'll leave the Internet Cafe. I've sent off the application. I've always wanted to be a lawyer. You can be whatever you like. It's the land of opportunity. Any fool can become president. Call when you hear about the interview. Okay, so now we gotta wait for the lawyers to contact us. And the thing about this is that this is, um, uh, you know, ne uh, what I find the strangest about that is that Nico on his resume uses uses his first and his real first and last name. Sorry. You don't think that that's the first thing that they would check when, like, um, uh, Nico's gonna do what he's gonna do? But I guess we'll be wrapping it up here, guys. On the next part, I will be going to the, um, lawyer's office for that interview. But before we go off here, I wanted to show you guys the, uh, the new apartment. So you unlock this, um, safe house after hostile negotiation where Roman gets kidnapped. So this is, you know, an Algonquin um, apartment, and I'm gonna say an apartment like this, especially in like downtown Manhattan, like this is, this is not too far from Central Park. This would be extremely expensive. This would be very, very, very expensive. This would be hundreds of thousands of dollars. This is, this oh, accidentally left, but that's what you know. Property prices in New York City are just are just through the roof. But um, uh, yeah, this is this is the place. Um, I still think Playboy's um, penthouse is better. But this also is a nice place. Um, so you got two safe houses in Algonquin. So um, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys on the next one. Take care, everyone.